Hi, this is Urban Sweetheart Teresa. I'm back with another wig review. Uh, I want to thank one viewer. Her name is Karen Davis, I think it is. She told me about my light. Maybe it was too close to the camera and she couldn't see the real effect of the makeup. Well, I've moved my lighting back further and I think it's helping. You can see my face a little better now. It's not as blurred or overexposed. So I want to thank you for that, Karen. Okay, so today I will be reviewing this wig right here. I have it in two colors. I have it in Empress. Let me use this one. Empress uh, Lace Wigs. This is Carmen. And I'm going to try it on in a 1B color. I also have it in the DKPU, which is dark purple. All right, comes in this type of packaging right here. It has lace front. And I took it out yesterday. I was going to do this yesterday. When I tried it on, it had a hump up at the top. So I converted, I wet it, put a little bit of um, styling mousse, converted it and put it on this container I've used on a different wig. I've just put it inside to try to mold it down. Anyway, so while we're here, let's look. It has uh, two combs on the sides, this hard lace. Um, this is the cap instruction, comb in the back and adjustable straps. This is a curl unit, as you can see, very bouncy curls. I'm going to take this out and flip it. I don't think I'm going to cut the lace off of it. I'm just going to try it on. See how it goes. The purple one I have um, worn one time. So I can show you that one without the lace on it. the lace it's going not all the way to ear to ear it's only coming to about right here which is still pretty good okay I think this hump is completely settled Curls. Let me to move this wig cap back to the sun. Here's the hairline. It's right here. Still feels a little bit humpy to me. <sighs> but I think I'm just going to have to style around it. Anybody else? Um, You know, I have a condition with the ingrown hairs. I'm going now through treatments. I'm up to my fourth treatment. I go to um, <clears throat> next month, fourth treatment. I still have these scar old scars but pretty much the hair it's very minimal it's been two weeks since I went and I can feel a little bit of peach fuzz in this area other than that it's just the old scarring I have gotta find something to help remove that All right back to this wig review I don't know there's not too much you can do with this unless you're just gonna really be trying to comb out the curls or Finger in them. I probably would just sweep it over. 
and maybe pin it to try to knock this poof off the top. you know, swoop it over. I think that that that's the best way to do this. It minimizes the hump up here. And if you can pin it down or something or swoop it behind the ear, I think you can get away with it. All right. Let's try to get you a side view. As far as I can turn that. like this unit with the parting. I don't want to disturb the curls too much. I don't think you really get any. I think this is just some bull I'm talking about lace in the front. Just lace for you to cut off. Maybe you get a quarter of an inch. It's not even worth trying to part. I would find a way to swoop it and go. Swoop and go. That's it. So, it's a cute wig. It is. I like it. I definitely am going to rock it. Like I said, find a way it's comfortable that you can swoop it and go. I love it because it's fall is coming and now is the time when you know, you need a wig that can take the wind blowing and everything. Curly wigs normally do it for me. You know, the straight ones, you're running for your life trying to get inside and straighten it back up where, where this, you won't have that problem. Especially if you can pin it where that hump won't show. All right, so I'm going to try the dark purple one on now. Let me show you the stock cards and you want to. Color DKPU. I wore this one once and I got a lot of stares. <laughs> you know, it's very bright in the daytime sunlight. Let's see if you can see that here. It's coming a little bit muted, but you can see. You see how bright now? Just imagine with some sunlight hitting it. All right. I'm checking now. I wore this at the back. It hasn't matted up or anything. All right. And I cut the lace off. I can show you now where I was saying, you know, you might as well forget about parting this. This is the front with a lace. After I cut it, you're not going to be able to do anything with that. So you just best to find a no part style. And run with it. See, I love it. This is a beautiful wig. It really is. And I think I only paid uh probably fifteen dollars for it. I'm trying to remember where I got it from. If I do remember, I'll put it down in the description box. This one, yeah. Just line it up best you can. Like I said, it comes about here, about to here, so not all the way to the ear. But, you know, if you want to pull out here, I wouldn't with this color because it's not rooted. And the hump wasn't as bad on this one as it is in the black. No big hump. This is like just curls because I had it pulled to the side. She could take it back if you want the other one. But this is my side right here. So, so I'm thinking it's already molded to how I want it. Beautiful curls. Beautiful curls. Side view. I probably could pull them apart more if you wanted to. I just like to let mine fall. A uh, wig like this normally collapses me 
a season. So maybe this will be good into a good into the winter. It depends how much you know. Since now I bought two of them, I can rotate. So maybe I can make it to the spring with these wigs. The back side, bouncy full curls. I'm liking the purple more than the black because I love color. <laughs> um, okay, I guess that's all I can say about these wigs. Easiest put on, cut you know, cut the lace, put it on, and if you're lucky, you don't get a hump like this one didn't have a big hump. You can just go if you get a hump. I could have got away with wearing it yesterday after I wet it and put the um, style in um mousse on it because it did flatten down so i'm thinking you could get away with wearing it you know once you did that you smoothed it down real good and maybe would have to have pinned a, a few of them down to hold that down and then just covered it with the remaining curls but these wigs i know i paid a, a cheap price that's why i got more than one beautiful curls if you're one of those girls that likes curls yeah, this is a nice wig. Thank you for watching. Please rate, subscribe, and comment. I do read the comments, and I appreciate constructive criticism. You know, I just started this channel. So um, I do listen and try to improve on the videos because I like wearing wigs, and I like um, sharing, you know, so other people can um, see a wig before they purchase, you know, to see if you're going to like it or maybe you can do something different with this wig that I don't know about and you can share it and, you know, that's how it works in this world. We sh all share. If we all share, we're all going to come out winners. God bless. Have a great day.